Hello. Hi. Hi Thanks for you? having us. <sighs> Describe your house in one word. One word, minimalist. One thing you need to get started in the morning. Prayer. What time does your alarm go up? Five o'clock. Welcome in Danny to your manor in Lady Catherine's voice. Welcome in Daddy TV to a posh brim manor. Are you coming? If you are, girl. Tell us the story behind this really cool wall. Um, I've always wanted the map of Nigeria in my house. Um, just because I think, I mean, I'm a Nigerian citizen and I'm part of my country and I love my country. So I got it done. A guy named Somi from Instagram, he makes his paints and does designs. He came over, took him three days and this is it. Cool. Last thing you ate. Indomie. Is hot dog a sandwich? Let's see. Animal between two pieces of bread? I will say so. Yes. Is stew a soup? No, stew is stew. Stew soup. So no. Most interesting thing about you? Most interesting thing about me is my ability to be spontaneous. I can sing about anything. Acting or comedy? Acting. Last time you cried? A couple of days ago. If you could have one last dance with your dad, what would you dance to? A song called Butterfly Kisses. If your life was a movie, what would the title be? It's a crazy, crazy world. If you could change one thing about yourself, what would it be? I'll be more assertive. What is something everyone looks stupid doing? Giving master classes about something they know nothing about. One dance thread that would look silly in five years. Zanku. What is your typical day like? Uh, wake up in the morning, check my e no, sorry, wake up in the morning, pray, check my emails, answer what I need to answer, and then probably go back to sleep, depending on what my day is going to be like. In one sentence, how would you sum up the internet? It's an interesting beast. Fame or popularity? Which one comes with more money? If animals could talk, which would be the rudest? Squirrels and raccoons. Favorite Nigerian show? Skinny Girl in Transit. How would your friends describe you in three words? Um, my friends would describe me as loving, giving, and the best friend that they've ever had. <laughs> what does love mean to you? Love is giving of your time. Most embarrassing pickup line used on you? Yeah, beauty is a queen. What words do you live by? Words I live by, um, stay humble, stay grounded, don't forget where you're coming from. When were you genuinely starstruck? When I met myself in the mirror. I was like, Chico, was that you? <gasps> oh no. Your most treasured item? Um, I like my little knickknacks that I pick up along the way when I travel, so I like to just collect little things like that. And of course, my Converse sneakers. This is another really cool one, by the way. Thank you. <laughs> most ridiculous thing said about you? That I was fat. If you had a talk show, what would it be called? It would be called... For real? On the real? Really? <laughs> tell us a secret. If I tell you, it wouldn't be a secret anymore, would it? Best Wi-Fi name you have seen? Never took light. How many chickens would it take to kill an elephant? If you add a rat, I would say five. Best thing about living in Lagos? Um, the life. It's it's where we work. It's a hub. It's a good place for entertainers to be. How do you feel about people who eat beans and egg? It's a gassy affair. Please do not fart me and open flame. What does beauty mean to you? Beauty is being comfortable in your own skin and loving yourself. What advice would you give your younger self? Um, when they said you were too muscular and you look like a boy, you'd have just stayed that way. You'd have filled out eventually, but you took it upon yourself to now eat so that you have curve in your mind. Now the curve is more than one. One last question. If your life were a hashtag, what would it be? Hashtag that why. All right, thanks, Chico. You're welcome. Okay, bye. Bye. Go. Why are you still here? Like, get out. <laughs> <laughs>